This man lost half of his head as a teenager because he wasn't wearing a seatbelt in 1999. His name is Carlos Rodriguez and he was driving around in a stolen car when he swerved and crashed into a pole. Not only was Carlos drunk and high, but he wasn't wearing a seatbelt during the accident and he went flying through the windshield. He smashed his head on the concrete and doctors had to remove a significant portion of his skull and brain to keep him alive. Carlos was only 14 years old when he became the man with literally half a brain. He somehow been able to live a normal life as his brain wasn't severely affected from the procedure. In this video, Carlos warns people not to drive under the influence. That's why it's no good drinking and driving or drug, drug, drugness and driving. No good kids, no good. Unfortunately, his near-death experience did not discourage him from committing any more crimes, as he was arrested in 2010 for trying to hire an escort. He was arrested again in 2016 for attempted murder and arson, when he set his mattress on fire and the blaze almost killed his neighbors. Follow me for more creepy stories, and it's crazy how...